Samsung is reportedly gearing up to launch a new Galaxy AI tool designed to summarize notifications for its users. This feature, which the Korean tech giant might introduce with One UI 7.0, has recently been making waves because it seems to take inspiration from Apple. Here's the twist. Samsung could be on track to deliver it even better. Notification summaries in iOS are part of Apple's intelligence suite, which at present is available only in English, with Apple planning to expand support to a few more languages in 2025. Samsung, by contrast, already offers Galaxy AI in multiple languages. So if notification summaries come to one UI, it's likely that they will support more than just English. According to a recent rumor, via Chun Bai, Samsung's notification summaries may be offered in several languages, including English, Chinese, Vietnamese, Thai, Japanese, and French. If we were to speculate, we'd say notification summaries could become available in every language that Galaxy AI supports. Samsung's Galaxy AI is already accessible in 20 languages with multiple dialects, with more on the way. Between the two companies, Samsung and Apple, it appears that Samsung is truly pushing to democratize generative AI, aiming to make AI-based tools accessible to as many people, regions, and languages as possible. Currently, the list of Galaxy AI tools that use language recognition includes Live Translate, Call Translate, Chat Assist, Interpreter, Note Assist, Transcript Assist, Browsing Assist. That said, Samsung hasn't confirmed anything regarding AI-based notification summaries yet, so it's worth waiting to see how this unfolds. The latest autoblocker update for One UI 6.1.1, version 1.100.28, introduced several new features but didn't stop there. Interestingly, the update changelog hints at additional security features that should activate once Samsung Galaxy phones receive the anticipated One UI 7.0 update. With autoblocker version 1.100.28, Samsung added further security layers for devices on One UI 6.10 via the maximum restrictions mode. This move initially launched earlier this summer, but the latest update introduced extra layers such as disabling actions by device admin apps and work profiles whenever maximum restrictions mode is enabled. Specifically, the change log for autoblocker version 1.100.28, as found on APK Mirror, mentions that maximum restrictions mode will gain three new features with One UI 7.0. Block USB connections. Block 2G networks. Prevent automatic reconnections to non-secure Wi-Fi networks. Curiously, the block USB connections feature already exists, but the other two don't. This could either be a Samsung oversight or indicate that the block USB connections feature will gain additional settings in One UI 7.0. I hope you liked the video. If you enjoyed the video, subscribing to the channel would be greatly appreciated. That's it for today. What's your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, see you in the next video. Peace out.